my nakiaikes. I urge your lordships and my lady to indeed look at the 32 volumes of Form 32, 34As placed before you. Do a comparison with the 45 which we have submitted and a report has been placed before you that numbers did not change. If they could not impeach on the 45 polling stations that they pleaded, they cannot impeach on the rest that are available before you. When we look at the other stations they have talked about, Nyandarua Kiheho, my learned colleague, Ms. Njomo, indeed confirmed that materials were all there in the ballot boxes which were opened. His concern was that they were not placed in tamper-proof envelopes. He's also confirmed that the numbers in those polling stations are there. Those were the submissions by Mr. Njomo on behalf of the petitioners. As regards Old Jororok, where he quoted that there were no seals placed, when you look at the report of the registrar in that particular polling station, appearing at page 141 to 171, no polling station had variances in terms of the numbers that were awarded to either the petitioner or my client. In short, my lady, my lordship, I submit that there is no evidence that has been placed before you to impeach the Forms 34A, which are already before you and which are in the portal, and which actually is where the vote from the voter, where the voter is expressing their choice of the candidate whom they would want to place in the executive office was done. No wonder Kenya has moved on. I want to beseech this honorable court to allow that which the people of Kenya made as a choice on the 9th and they declared on the 15th to be the choice of the leadership they would want to lead this country for the next five years. I am a product of that particular election. The Honorable Madam Chief Justice, allow me one minute to close. Thank you. I wondered yesterday while uh, Malane Senior, the Honorable Attorney General Emeritus, invited you to ask the Honorable James Orengo and uh, Professor uh, Tom agenda, I would invite myself to answer that I am a product of that election that was conducted and I am aware that if one is clear, the rest will be clear as we have attempted and have indeed proved in the submissions that are before you. I request and I plead that this Honorable Court upheld the declaration that was made on the 15th of August 2022 of the presidential elections. I thank you for the time and thank you. I will donate the remaining 13 seconds to the court. Thank you very much. Uh, 